Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and we're going to answer a question that I had a few times this week and it has to do with people saying that they are on Windows 7 on their laptops or their PCs and when they go to the uh, website of their manufacturer HP, Lenovo, Toshiba or whatever it uh, mentions that their PC is not supported for Windows 10. What does that mean exactly, that it's not supported for Windows 10? Does that mean Windows 10 is not going to work on it? Well, not really. So I have here a, maybe eight or nine laptops, okay? Out of those nine laptops, one is very recent, my Acer Nitro 5. Of course, this one supports Windows 10. But all the other ones are about ranging from 3 to 10 years in age. And if you go to the website of the manufacturer, so some are Toshiba's, I've got a Dell, I've got a uh, old Acer, and if you go, of course, like I say on the website, uh, I've got an HP. If you go on their website, it stipulates that Windows 10 is not supported on these machines. But, well, I can tell you one thing is they all have run Windows 10 perfectly well. Why do they say it's not supported? It's because they have not updated drivers. They have not done any updates. And, frankly, they say that most of the time because the PC still works on Windows 10. But they'd rather have you buy another one than actually upgrade to Windows 10 and still continue using the same old computer. So if you're on Windows 7, or even on Windows 8.1, and your PC manufacturer website stipulates that it's not supported for Windows 10, the chances of you being able of running Windows 10 perfectly well are very high. In general, PCs that are not more than about five or six years all pretty much run Windows 10 without any problems. There could be exceptions to the rule, but they are very few apart. More than five or six years, uh, that's where it starts to get a little tricky. Some will work well, some will have problems, and it has to do with drivers that are not updated or have not been updated in a long, long time. Sometimes it has to do with the different technologies that the computer is using from that time that today is incompatible for some reason. But overall, if you go to your manufacturer's website, it tells you, well, this is not supported for Windows 10. You probably can still upgrade to Windows 10, and it's still going to work fine. And remember, Windows 7, Windows 8.1 users, you can still upgrade to Windows 10 for free on your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.